Okay, so you're thinking of drinking your tap water, but ugh, you don't want to do that. You don't trust the government. I get that. You don't trust the government. What do, does the government do right, huh? Okay, and you've been buying plastic water bottles, but it costs you a lot of money. You know it's bad for the environment, and it's really bad for the environment, by the way. And it's made of plastic, which is petroleum, which is, causes high-level estrogen, and it's made by a manufacturer, and it tastes good, but you don't know for sure is all the toxins out of the water. It's not. Just so you know, a little secret, it's not. They just buy it from cities, they run it through a carbon filter, make it taste good, and then they sell it to you, and you think you're getting more healthy water. So what can you do? Well, you're on this page to learn about reverse osmosis systems, and I'm gonna to try to do it as quickly as I can because it's a very complicated uh, situation. So in essence, I'm gonna review basically three categories of systems out there. That would be big box, sticker companies, and professional companies. And I'm first gonna start out with what is reverse osmosis so we can be clear about it. So to begin with, da -da -da, reverse osmosis systems is where we rip, clean the water. We push this water through a semi-permeable membrane where when we do that, we rip everything, including the minerals off the water, okay? That's because a filter doesn't know what's calcium, which is a mineral, or what's a toxin like, oh, forever chemicals. So what do we need to do? We need to push it through that membrane and get everything off. Now, this is where a lot of people say, oh my God, you don't want that because it's dead water. You want minerals in your water. Well, a good reverse osmosis, a good water treatment company will add minerals back to the water. So don't fear, don't fret. That is something that you can do. Every reverse osmosis system that we do, whether you buy a big box stick, uh, product from us, a sticker product from us, or a professional grade product from us, we're always gonna add minerals back to the water. So don't fret. Now, that said, we want good healthy water. Remember, you're a big filter, right? You're 60% water, your brain's 90% water, maybe even 70% water. You are nothing more than a gigantic water, a gigantic filter. So what you consume, you become. So your mom was right. What you eat, if you eat a banana in four hours, you're that banana. If you drink a glass of water, in four minutes, you're that glass of water. And being a filter, esophagus, kidney, uh, esoph uh, stomach, you got intestines, you got kidney, you got liver, you got all these things that are actually pulling what you consume and making that part of your body, it seems to me, or at least it's my passion, is I want to get that stuff out for you. I want to make sure there are no toxins in your water. And the best way that I can do that is to teach you about good quality reverse osmosis systems. Now, we said we're going to break that down into three categories, and I'm going to break it down even further. We're going to look at is it NSF 58 listed? That means National Sanitation Foundation, did they test it? Did they throw the toxins at the at, uh, with, with the water at the filter and did it take it out? We're gonna judge it on that. We're gonna judge it on how often you have to change the filters. We're gonna judge the system on whether or not it's made in America. We're gonna judge it on whether or not it comes with a metal high quality faucet. And lastly, we're gonna rate it on zero or one to 10 how is the service on it? Because at our company, we service all makes and models, so we wanna make sure that we share that knowledge with you because you can get buffaloed by the different products on the market. So, no, with no further ado, let's begin with the big box products, right? This is where you can go to Menards, you can go to Home Depot, you can go to Lowe's. What you're gonna find is one of two systems. One, of the, both, one is gonna be GE, the other one's gonna be Whirlpool. Here is the b basis of it, if you see them, they are got little teeny filters, tiny, tiny filters. Compare that to one of their biggest systems right here, right? It's, it's half the size. You actually need to change the filters on the big box system four times a year, the membrane every year. So that becomes expensive. The pro, if we're gonna use Ben Franklin, right? We're gonna write the pros on one side, the negatives on the other side. The pro is it's less expensive. The pro is it does reduce TDS. The con is, I don't know if it takes out toxins or not because they didn't invest into the NSF certification. Um, the other con is the fact that you have to install it or hire a plumber to install it. So it goes from four or $500 to over $1,000 for you to install it. Um, it is uh, not made in America. It does not have a metal faucet. It has a plastic faucet that painted chrome. And we rate this as one or two as far as service goes. The manufacturer's warranty 
is nine months or a year. So it sort of tells you that the manufacturer doesn't really trust it themselves because they gave you such a short warranty. So again, I know if you're on a budget, you might go down that path. That I understand. If I had to pick the one between the two of those, I'd probably pick the Whirlpool, being a little bit higher quality, a little bit less service problems. Now we're going to move into sticker companies. This is where all the online stuff happens. So if you're looking at Aquasana, if you're looking at Pelican, if you're looking at th this company, this discount company, that discount company, they basically buy a RO from China and they throw their name on it. Okay? So I'm not going to go through each one of them because honestly, none of them really make them all that big and they all get them from a few different manufacturers in China. So what I'm going to explain to you that to begin with, there's one sticker company out there that's pretty big that actually is about the best in the industry as far as sticker companies go. Now, it's a major corporation name called A.O. Smith. Now, they don't, they're a manufacturer of water heaters. They decide to get in the water business, but they're buying the filter from another company and putting their name on it. Now, that filter system that they sell is NSF 58 listed. Yay, that's great. Um, the filters change them about once a year in most cases. Yay, that's pretty great. Um, is it made in America? No, it's not. How is the faucet? Yes, it's a good quality faucet. We finally, we see good, good steel in there. And then lastly though, the service. We're back there on a lot of service calls on these units, so we rate that a four. So overall, the system's not too bad. If we're looking at Benjamin Franklin here, again, the pro is NSF 58 listed, big name, A.O. Smith on it. Um, the filter is about once a year. Um, it's, uh, the faucet is made of metal. The negative is, is that its service is four and it's not made in America. So that you have to weigh out. That price point is usually around $1,500 installed. So uh, we also find that that product, they give it a five-year warranty. Um, sometimes the dealers who buy it and put their name on it will actually extend it to 10 years. But again, you're trusting that dealer that does that. Now, there's a lot of other sticker products on the market. I'm going to point to them. You'll see this guy. You'll see this guy. You'll see this guy. You'll see this guy. You're going to see some of the, you'll see this Glacier Park. It's like, who are these guys? Listen, basically they all bought it from China. The thing is, is that if you go to any, if you go to NSF uh, and you enter the name of the company, you're not going to find them listed. And when you go there, so we don't know anything about it, and we're going to trust the Chinese to give you good, clean water. Really? I mean, we know that's what's happened. We can't trust them for for the drywall that has, was a major epidemic after uh, Hurricane Andrew. We can't trust them for flooring. Discount, discount uh, lumber liquidators, what, what did they do? They had formaldehyde and they listed the boxes as formaldehyde free, certified stamp. Can you really trust that? I don't know. If you feel like it, you can. For me, whenever we service them, I can tell you we can't. And in fact, many cases, we didn't even check the TDS on these units and they wouldn't even be filtering the water very well. We'd get 50% of the particles taken out of it. So when we come to them, the other negative of them is that they, are, they all have BPA. That is still made with BPA. That's made with BPA. The, the big box items are made with BPA. In fact, that's another negative is they have BPA in them. And boy, the boy, oh boy, if you have children, if you're elderly, if you're pregnant, you should not be drinking water that possibly could be ha or held in a BPA container. So that would make sense if you can't do that. Remember, if you have children, they always say this, is, this, this sippy cup is BPA free. This bottle is BPA free. Well, what about the RO system that's purifying the water, that's mixing the formula? You've got to make sure that's BPA free. So no, <laughs> no, 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 they're not BPA free. So you have to be the vigilant and look, at, look out for this for your own family. Now, um, this other problem with the sticker companies is that when we have bought them and sold them for clients because they hit a price point, they usually run about twelve dollars to $1,300 installed because they cost us $700, $600. So we mark it up. We had our, add our plumbing. And so from there, you think to yourself, okay, it's not a bad price point. So the price point's a win. 
Um, we see that they actually do work pretty good, some of them, for a while, but then we can not get filters because the manufacturer stops selling to America. Or we find out from a client that, uh, that the water, that the system stopped working. So we rate most of the sticker companies as a four or five based on the fact that we can't always get the filters. And we also rate it that low because it's not BPA free. Now, we're going to step to some of the professional companies that are out there. These are sometimes the names of companies you might know. So we're going to start with Culligan. Culligan, we're going to, again, rate this. We're going to say uh, on a negative, no, it's not 58 listed. Yes, filters once a year, that's a positive. Made in America, no. A metal faucet, yes. Service, yes, it's a nine. So, and the TDS does drop. So if I have to rate Culligan overall, the TDS is pretty clean, is very good, the reduction is very good. Again, total dissolved solids is what TDS stands for. That's the reduction when we push this water through the membrane. How much stuff did it take off? So we think it's going to give you good clean water, but again, they didn't pay for the certification, so we really don't know. If you want to trust a major manufacturer's name, Culligan might not be a bad call for you. Uh, again, you now know the pros and cons. Rainsoft, another major manufacturer, right? Well, they no longer make it in America, so that's a no. Uh, when we look at the filters, uh, it changed them once a year. That's a yes. That's a fantastic thing. Metal faucet, yes. Service, nine, yes. That's another major corporation that the service is, is very good. You don't have to do a lot. Uh, and the uh, filters usually have to change once a year. TDS reduction is very good at 90 to 95%. Another positive where we think that it's good at giving you good clean water, but again, they didn't pay the money to have NSF tested. So that, to me, rates it down a little bit. We have the same scenario with Kinetico. We have a, a situation where, yes, it's positive because it's changing the filters once a year. The faucet is metal. That's a yes. The service is a nine. The negative is it's not made in America. It's not NSF 58 listed. So again, if you're hoping and trusting, that's a major corporation in America, even though they're making it in China today, you can trust them, I guess, if that's what you want to do. Um, Pantera, we find that that is NSF 58 listed, we think. That's this guy over here. Um, that's very confusing when you go to the NSF website. Um, that particular model is not listed, but they have a couple that are. So we're a little confused by that. We have to get some clarity. Uh, filters about once a year, yes. Made in America, no. So that's a negative. Uh, the faucet is metal, yes. But the service is a five. So that means we have to go back quite often on that unit because we have to service it. So, um, so little pros and cons there, again, something that you need to decide on. Now, um, none of these, not the, not the big box products, not the sticker products, and not these uh, large corporations or big uh, manufacturers I just listed, none of them are BPA free. We're going to get to the next one, which I do like, and we do tend to try to guide our customers to. It is the most expensive, but when it comes to your health and welfare, your children's health and welfare, I think that money really shouldn't be the object because we can rent them for you at $35 a month or we can sell you the system and finance it and it's a lot cheaper than buying bottled water. By the way, the average family that gets bottled water delivery from us is $50 a month so we can certainly beat that with a pure Assure Eco Water system. So that's this guy over here. The Pure Assure system is designed to actually B certified, NSF 58. It is made in America. You change the filters about once a year. The faucet is metal, and it does, the service on it is a nine. We don't have too many problems with it as long as it's on some filtered water to begin with. That means you have a water softener or a carbon filter before it. If you don't, there's always an extra filter we can add before that. So that makes it a nine. This is why, for me, coming from the healthcare industry, this is a great product, and it's the only one on the market that's BPA-free. So again, if you're elderly, if you're an infant, if you're children, have little kids, if you're pregnant, that's the product that I'd want to direct you to because it's gone through all those testings to make sure that it's the best water on the market or best water for you. Now, I love the fact that Eco Water actually is also owned by Warren Buffett because he's put the resources behind it to actually make sure this water is great for you. What we hope is that 
we've clearly spelled out to you that there's three categories of manufacturers or companies out there selling products. Um, there's going to be big box. That's going to be the Menards, Lowe's, and, and, uh, and Home Depots of the world. They're going to carry one of two products, and those are just okay, low price entry, one year or less warranty on the unit. Uh, service is a three or two or four at most. Um, and so uh, it's so so. I'm sorry, there are two. Sticker co companies like AO Smith, overall not BPA free. We rated a four. Um, Yes, it's NSF 58 listed, which is a great thing. So it might be something that would work for you and your family. I'm not sure. All the other sticker companies, basically, whether it's Pelican or if it's uh, Aquasana, they're buying something from China, sticking their name on it. And be wary of those beautiful websites that say all these beautiful things. And by the way, they sort of allude, tested two NSF standards. Well, who tested it? I've seen that all over the internet. Tested two NSF standards by the Chinese? Really? <laughs> you couldn't trust them? Who, did you go there and watch them? I mean, I don't know. See, I don't know. What I do know is NSF is a not-for-profit in the United States, and I do trust them. So someone that's concerned about your health, that's what weighs me to say, eh, we might want to steer away from one product or another. Um, when we get to the major corporations out there, these are going to be Culligan, Rainsoft, Connecticut, Eco, which is the Pure Sure system, and the uh, Pentair. We rate the Eco water system the best, but all did a very good job in reducing the TDS. All of them need filters about once a year, and all of them had a nine, except for Pentair, had a five in regards to the serviceability of the product. That means how many times we had to go back. Nine means we barely saw them. Five means we were there quite a bit. So I hope this helps you out because, again, my passion is to make you and your family more healthy. If you have any questions on that, please visit us at uh, angelwater.com. Um, I'm Drew the Water Guru, and I'm here to serve you. Have a great day.